everyone, this is Samantha at As They Grow Up and today I'm going to share with you um, the gifts that we give for the 12 days of Christmas. A couple of weeks ago I had mentioned that we started last year doing the 12 days of Christmas for my husband. It was just a great way to show him how much we appreciate him for all that he does. Because of what he does, it allows us to be me to be able to stay home with the boys as well as homeschool them. And that just really means a lot to us. So as part of showing our appreciation, we decided to start doing the 12 days of Christmas. I will admit that at first it sounded really neat being able to uh, match items up per day. You know, one of this, two of that, three of that. But in the big picture, it can get pretty stressful. Because I don't want to get him things that he doesn't need or that he doesn't use. I want to get him things that he's mentioned that he'd like to have or that I know he uses. So with that being said, I took the boys out shopping so they could pick out the gifts that they want to give their dad this 12 days of Christmas. Luke is the odd numbers and Davis is the even numbers. And they um, each decorated bags. So they have 12 bags that they've decorated that they're going to be putting their gifts in. And I will start with number one, which was yesterday. If you're just now watching this, um, it was a stainless steel mug. And this was Luke's gift from yesterday, which was number one. Um, he uses a lot of stainless steel glassware, so I thought this would be great. Um, the second day of Christmas, we got him this. It's from um, Nine Line Clothing, and it is Freedom to All and to All a Good Night. Who doesn't need an ugly Christmas sweater slash <laughs> shirt? So anyway, I, we got him this. So we did order this. They just started coming out. Uh, it was the eighth and so along with the shirt they threw in a koozie hey Luke. Um, and uh, there's a sticker so that's what it's supposed to be okay so for day number three we are doing the we love these larissa's kitchen it's one of our favorites and uh, it's grass-fed beef and um, so we're doing that and then they are also putting some slim jims in with that bag so there's that Day number four, his favorite, eggnog. Uh, so there's number four. Day number five, boxers. Why boxers? Well, because I love my husband, but he hates buying things like this. He will not buy this stuff. So he did mention that he needed boxers, and he. Uh, so we picked him up some of these today. So that is for that. So that's day number five. Oh, yes, and there are five boxers, so that day actually did match up, so five. Um, day number six, pajama bottoms. Davis picked some of these out. Uh, they're Call of Duty, so that is day number six. Day number seven, um, the Snyders of Hanover, the uh, pretzel pieces. This is the hot buffalo wings. Luke picked out this flavor. He thinks he'll like it, so we got this flavor. So that's day number seven. Day number eight, this also matched up. Uh, he chews a lot of gum. I'm not a gum chewer, but Ryan and Luke are both big gum chewers. And so this is an eight pack. So this is going to be definitely number eight on that. Number nine, pistachios. So he loves pistachios, and this is basically a treat. I don't buy pistachios a lot. When we do, it's because we splurge and we buy them. And um, so this I did get. So that is day number nine. Day number 10, his favorite, Nutella. He loves this stuff, and this will probably be gone in a couple of weeks, I'm sure. So between day, uh, Ryan and, and Luke, they both love the Nutella. They'll eat it by the spoonful, so there's that. Um, number 11, we picked up this little marker band here. Um, He's going to be training for a big bike race coming up this coming year. So he's going to be on the road a lot. And while he does have a headlight and a back blinky light on his bicycle and wears reflective gear, when he rides, this is just an extra add-on here. And so it'll do a solid and a little blinky. We actually got this at Home Depot um, Black Friday. So it was just kind of a little stocking stuffer thing. And last but not least are the dark chocolate sea salt caramel. So, there's a backstory that I'll have to share with you guys sometime about the whole dark chocolate thing. But, um, he does, we do like the Ghirardelli's and um, this is one of his favorites. So, that was that. 
Okay guys, that is it. That is our 12 days of Christmas. And the boys are getting ready to box up, bag all these up, and we're going to staple them shut, and they can hand it out every day. They're going to take turns. Today is Davis's day to hand his gift. But if you guys do 12 days of Christmas, I would love to hear about it. Um, also, any ideas are welcome if you have any suggestions on what would be a good add-in for next year. So thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day.